the game to see the boxing boys. Welcome back, gang, for the first time and hopefully many more to come. Don't forget to subscribe to the YouTube channel and click on the notifications right here, this little bell, so you can get those emails every time we go live. Peace. Boxing Voice here with Steven Ortiz, new WBF champion, uh, Sante Vander Holyfield, Real Deal Boxing. All right, champ, let me get your take on a fight that's coming up. Uh, Adrian Brona, Omar Figueroa. Oh, man, that's a, I was just talking about that. Well, that's going to be tough as hell. Uh, Brona just got to stay composed and really be in his game, like, in, you know, the way he's been before. But if he's not, Omar Figueroa is going to pick him apart, just throwing a lot of shots. Mm. A lot of hard shots, too. Mm. So, and he put that pressure, so I see Brona got some trouble with that. Mm. Love Brona, but if he's not in his game plan, it's going to be hard. Okay, now... Do you think that there's a blueprint now? Do you think that people just kind of just follow the Madonna blueprint and say, because we kind of seen Mikey Garcia do a little bit of that, but he did a lot more turning, and you know. Figueroa is going to be the harder one because he's just awkward. He's everywhere throwing shots. This is going to be hard for Brown. I ain't going to lie. If he's not on his game, on his A game, definitely. Okay. But uh, game plan, people just see like if, he's, if, if, if they put the pressure on him and, and he's not ready for that, then it would be a hard night for him. Um, but if he's in shape, then. It's gonna be hard night, hard night for that guy. What does Omar Figueroa have to do in order to come in and? He just gotta do what he do. He's just awkward, throw a lot of shots, a lot of hard punches from different angles. He's just weird. He's just in and out. He's, he's can't really explain him, but he gets the win every time. Okay. Uh, do you think a win like this for Broner puts him back yeah. on track? Definitely, definitely. Omar Figueroa is a tough opponent. Well, he's not even an opponent. He's a fucking two-time world champion. So, mm. and he just stopped Robert, Robert Guerrero, which a mm. lot of guys didn't stop. So. It definitely get him right back, right back in the mat. Okay, now Adrian Brown has said it just switched trainers. Do you think that you know? Do you think that it was the trainers, or do you think that it might maybe have been? so? Maybe yeah. he needed a new trainer. Maybe uh, his old trainers couldn't either teach him no more, or mm -hmm. they couldn't control him. You know, he, end of the days, uh, he probably was his own boss. Okay. Sometimes you need somebody to tell you what you're not doing right and what you are. So maybe it was a good thing. How does the fight end? Oh, man. Depends if if Bron is on his game, great fight. If he's not, stoppage for for Omar. Mm. If he's not on his game, definitely puts mm. a lot of pressure. A lot of pressure. what is up, TBB family? Yes, yes. YouTube has been cutting funding to uh, their channels as of late, and with net neutrality uh, going through its process, the internet is changing. If you want to keep your favorite channel intact, coming up with tons of content, and plus get hours and hours of extra content, head over to patreoncom forward slash the boxing voice. Uh, to become a member of the TBV family and help support the channel. Peace.